guys, me again. Today I'm going to be doing a video on how to install cold cathode switches. Um, I got this as an inspiration from TJ Harlow. He actually has the exact same one. I bought these switches, three bucks a pop, I think, at Radio Shack. Um, they light up blue when they turn on. Um, they're LED toggle switches. I have three cold cathodes. I don't know if you can see them. There's one up top there. There's one on the side. Right there, and then there's one down at the bottom of my case. All you do, really simple. On the back of the switch, toggle switch, there are three prongs. One is ground, one is accessory, and one is power. It's labeled on the switch so you can uh, help you out there. So what all I did was I had a black cable and I attached it to the ground on the switch. Yellow cable attached to the power on the switch and the red attaches to the accessory on the switch. So all I do is solder them on to this, this switch here. Then what I did was a cold cathodes come with this PCI bracket switch here. That has a yellow power and a red accessory. I just cut them. I solder the, the yellow from this switch to the one to my switch. So it, what it really is, is it goes to this Molex connector here. The yellow, right? Follow this along here. I soldered it here. And this goes up to my switch. So this goes to the Molex. The red as well, right here. I soldered this right here. Going up to my switch. This also goes, this actually goes into the inverter box. And the ground, the most, this is probably the more complicated part. This comes from the Molex connector. I just cut it in half and I practically tapped into it since this was also connected to the inverter box. So I just cut, cut it in half and I added this wire to it. And that's really it. I mean, it's really simple. If you have any questions other than that, just uh, send me a message. Alright, thanks. See you next time. Like I just wanted to show you what the switches look like when I turn on. I uh, can't really see them. Let's turn this down. Turn this one on. Blue. That light there. And that one there, light. Turn this one on. And the one up there turns on. So that's what it looks like. It's actually pretty, it's a pretty easy install, and I think uh, most people can do it even if they don't have any electrical backgrounds. Alright guys, see you in the next video. Peace.